Hey, how's it going everyone? In today's video, we are going to be talking about the latest update, patch 1.061. There are quite a few changes towards bugs, specifically fixing gigs, quests, and all that good stuff. Yet there is one thing right here that they have definitely fixed, which is an exploit. What they specifically fixed was the corpse container glitch. If you're not aware how this would work, you would basically stick a corpse into a container. This would pop its loot out. You would grab the loot, go away, then come back within a short distance and the loot would pop up again. Now, not only this, they indeed fixed the fall damage glitch. So you can no longer use the guts shotgun, AKA Rebecca shotgun to stop your fall damage. And they also fixed the Neo Fiber glitch. So if you were trying to use that from my previous video when I posted that new glitch, then yeah, it no longer works. What you can do instead is duplicate your item still. All you have to do is drop an item towards the floor and then go up towards it. Make sure that it is indeed there and then you can grab it while pausing the game. You can then make a quick save and then load that sucker back up. You will know that you've done it incorrectly if there is no sound that is made when you do pick it up. If you just simply pick it up and pause and there's no sound and then you reload it back up, you will notice that, well, there's no weapon duped. So the best way to do this is to simply drop the weapon, then pick it up, make sure that you can hear that sound where it just makes the pickup sound and then you can then make a quick save. Reload that sucker back up and when you are back in, you will notice that there is a duplicated item within your inventory. I recommend this if you want a duplicated weapon. Now, does the Rebecca shotgun triple jump glitch work? Yes, indeed it does. All you have to use is your charged ankles or your fortified ankles, release it, and then shoot the shotgun right afterwards. If you are not able to do this still, then I highly recommend changing your cyber arm as this can somehow stop the glitch from working. I'm not too sure as to why. Moving on to the next one, we are going to discuss a stat glitch. This right here is quite useful. You will want to head towards a specific Ripper Dog towards the West Brooks, and you will want to purchase a Berserk mod or operating system. Once you have that added, you can then exit this Ripper Dog's location and then open up your inventory and choose a bat. You can use any weapon, yet the bat is the most easiest. As I was mentioning earlier, the Ripper Dog can be located right here in Westbrook, Charter Hill. Now, as I was mentioning before, I highly recommend that you equip a... So, now that we have the Berserk equipped, as well as the Baseball Bat, we are ready to perform the next step, and this one is quite simple. All you have to do is pay attention towards the Stamina Bar, towards the top left, as you are swinging. Then, release the Berserk and pause the game towards the inventory menu. Go towards your character, then go towards body, and then as you can tell, we are now in the Athletics tab. Towards the left here, it is 75, so I will wait it out for just a bit. And what we are doing here is we are doing the AFK XP glitch that involves Athletics. You just sit at this menu, do whatever you want, go eat a cheeseburger. I don't know why that popped up in my head, I'm probably hungry. Uh, it's American thing probably. The main point is just do whatever you want and then when you come back about an hour or two later, the athletics will be leveled up quite a bit. If you can tell, nothing's happening, right? There's no leveling up, no XP on the bottom left, so what's going on here? If you go towards the top right there and choose a different tab, this will not change the number at all either. So the best way to do this is go towards the very top where there's crafting, inventory, map, character, and journal. You will then want to choose one of those following tabs and then go back towards the body and athletics like I've done right here. And then you can tell it just went up one. You can continuously sit here and let yourself level up. And yeah, it's a great AF key athletics glitch. I highly recommend this because leveling athletics can be quite boring and I know just play the game I, I understand that moving on as I mentioned earlier since this new patch they have officially fixed the neo fiber glitch that involved completing Regina's last quest which is last call and the whole point behind that is you would grab the inventory item that she would give you which would be a quest icon you could then sell that towards a cyberware for an infinite amount of money. This no longer works because when you do sell it, you can instantly buy it back. So it's been patched. 
The best way to earn money afterwards is with a duplication glitch. If you guys are not aware, that one currently works. It's been around for quite some time and the fact that it currently works and they've patched all these other ones is kind of hilarious. So yeah, the Neo Fiber glitch no longer works so don't even try it. Let's go on and talk about the next one that I recommend that you do and that is the duplication glitch. All this involves is simply going over towards a drop point. We will then want to sell a stacked item. This is not meant for weapons. If you are mainly trying to duplicate that, then I recommend checking out the first glitch that we went over. Uh, that's if you skipped over it. We will then want to sell the whole stack, but take one away, hover your cursor over, hold down the F button. This is then going to pop that up. You can then sell that whole stack. This is then going to duplicate the amount. So purchase everything back and notice at the top, you are not losing any money. You're actually just purchasing everything back. You're not losing a single thing. So I highly recommend this if you do need a lot of grenades, medicine and stuff like that. As for mods and weapons, I do recommend the first glitch to duplicate that because that is possible uh, 100%. And there you go. I highly recommend that you try these out before they are patched because the next update will indeed probably fix these because they have just patched the Neo Fiber glitch that involved Regina. They have fixed the Guts shotgun fall damage glitch. That involved of course Rebecca's shotgun and of course last but not least they have fixed the whole duplication glitch that involved picking up a corpse throwing in a container and all that so with that quick recap that's what you pretty much have to uh, deal with with this new patch is just those three glitches they're officially out of here yet you can still duplicate you can still do all the glitches that we just went over and i highly recommend that you do these before they are patched as i've mentioned and yeah so there you go i hope that you guys have enjoyed the video if you are new to the channel feel free to subscribe turn on those notifications for all and if you have any questions leave them down below i will try to answer them within the first hour or two and of course i cannot forget about the members and everyone that is currently subscribed thank you all for supporting the channel and i will see you all on the next video